and brothers and sisters, thank you for viewing my videos. I've got more topics out there. Somebody was asking me what I actually meant when I said richness in one of my videos. And of course, it means the feeling to, to feel that you, because rich, richness, to be rich is a quality. It's not about your quantity or whatever exists. It's about how you feel. And I also wanted to touch a little more on tribalism because at verdant.net, which is dealing with consumerism, let's just, um, let's just think about what tribalism is. It's, it's more about community and it's less about separating yourselves in houses, etc. And consumerism is a pattern of behavior that helps to destroy our environment, our personal financial health, the common good of individuals and human institutions. And it is my hope to continue my apprenticeship as a, a social engineer by sharing these with you. And it's possible if I'm able to interact. So verdant.net, you'll see their link below. And um, I'm just going to do a review of the site for you guys, my opinion. And so basically they talk about taking action and the alternative economy. You see, many people are finding that the standard economic model no longer works for them because all of this money travels quickly and, and the New World Order supposedly wants to make a world uh, monetary system in which there's only one currency. And what that does is that helps all this money to get in the hands of people who are going to use it, the money, or as it's also called, energy, they're going to use it for their own self-interests. And I used to be a little worried about, well, what if the dollar fails? But if the dollar fails, we're going to resort to the other alternative, which is bartering and exchange. And that allows things to be much more localized and sustainable. Um, and with technology like the internet and so on and so forth, we should be able to communicate and, and bring that kind of close-knit society to a bigger and bigger scale so that we as Earth, as a, as a humanity, can unite. And, and so, forces beyond our control have changed the economic rules. And we're expected to continue consuming and responding to advertising and paying for our taxes but the deficit there is made up with our free time and our community's sovereignty people are turning away from this situation in disgust and are helping to develop an alternative economy as both healthy survival and a means of peaceful protest so, here's an example of the alternative economy. If you continue to shop at Costco, Home Depot, and Walmart, you can decide not to and shop at smaller stores because they emphasize personal contact and customer service. And we're all in this together guys so also you can join a credit union because these are nonprofit alternatives to banks usually without fees charges and advertising so as you know I'm I belong to soil seeds of inspirational living dot info which is a nonprofit and that's the way of the future man so if we can get part of that be part of that and act 
feet. So let's see. One of the others is to just create a list of your favorite local businesses and and shop there. And be strong, guys. Don't don't worry about it. It's going to be a little scary cuz we're changing, but because of all the action and getting together and talking to people and buying local products, we are going to be free. Freedom is Freedom is an incredible thing. Freedom is to truly not be pressured and, and to truly not feel like you need something. And when people think they need, then that creates fear. So there's so many positive options going on and the world is beautiful. Let's see, man. Let's make it. Let's make it that. So, to review, go to verdant.com for more info. Thank you.